Hello there people, this is Bruce Be Cool on Nintendo Bruce, and we are now up against Yuma on Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D's Decade Jewels. Now she has got quite a decent deck. It's a darkness control deck, I guess you could call it. So let's go through her monsters, spells, traps and see what we come up with. Let's get the traps out of the way as that's the easiest. She's got Torrential Tribute, Solemn Judgment, Mirror Force as per usual, uh, as well as Bottomless Trap Holes and Crush Card Virus. So not pretty, not pretty. Do be careful. And in terms of her spells, I've mentioned she's got Control. So she's got Mind Control to take your monsters over, as well as the usual Brain Control. And she's even bunged a couple of creature swaps in there as well. Very, very irritating. Now with this, she's got a lot of Tuna monsters in her deck. So if she's going to use Mind Control, besides attacking you directly, she might well use it for a, a tune summon of her own. And in the terms of a lot of tuning, she's got about six or seven monsters to tune with. It's uh, quite irritating, and she'll usually go for Goyo Guardian as well to try and take control of your monsters. Again, it's that control element that she concentrates on. I mean, look here. What have we got? Creature Swap. Uh, I've got a horrible feeling about that monster reborn, but we'll see what happens. Um, so, yeah, again, a lot of... Uh, summoning you know extremely high attack monsters with the tuning while trying to leave you defenseless very very irritating um, her other monsters she's got mystic tomato to find things like plague spread spread a zombie gale the whirlwind uh, and even her sangan you know what I knew it with the monster reborn how about that anyway uh, in terms of other high attack monsters which don't rely on the uh, tuning she's got the uh, gauze emissary of darkness obviously She's got Cyber Dragon, not too much to worry about, but it's a special summon. Uh, Chaos Sorcerer, because she's got Dark and Light monsters in her deck. And the Dark Arm Dragon, very, very irritating. Now, I forgot to mention as well, in terms of tuning, she's also got the Summoner Monk, which more often than not, she'll summon, and then sacrifice a spell card to bring out the Hyper Synchron, and then do an instant uh, Synchro Summon. So, again, just trying to bring out those high attack monsters straight away. Now, in terms of high attacks, sure, with beatdowns you might have a bit of trouble because she's trying to control you, but if you were to go for a staller, then that might well work against her. Sure, she might creature swap and get some of your effects, so if you're using a burner she'll get like this koala and whatnot, but in terms of magic and trap removal, she's only got Heavy Storm, Giant Trinade, Mystical Space Typhoon, as per usual, obviously the Solemn Judgments. And yes, if she is lucky enough to get Dark Arm Dragon out, she can destroy three of your cards. But I'd probably lean towards that more so than anything else. So yeah, whacking the Messenger of Pieces, uh, Gravity Bind, mm, or Level Limit Area B, maybe. I only say maybe because of Gale the Whirlwind and Sangan as well to attack you. So yeah, be a little bit careful. Um, other than that, there's not really much to say. Like I say, if you can control a field, then great, but she does have a lot of opportunity to special summon things. So if you are running a beatdown deck, you might want to consider the things which negate special summons. So say, Royal Oppression, uh, Thunder King Ryu, uh, Bottomless Trap Holes, Torrential Tribute, and try and get her to waste her hand. So I think we can pretty much leave it at that. So try and control her hand if you can, try and take control of the field early and then you won't have too much of a problem or just go for the staller, try and burn her um, and go for your ultimate strategy with your own staller. Anyway, I'll leave you to enjoy the rest of the video and uh, any comments or questions, as per usual, write them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. In the meantime, you guys take care of yourselves and I'll see you again soon.
Thank you. 